Good morning, everybody. It's me again, Crazy Bag Lady. It's Monday. Ugh. But we have blue skies. Woohoo! It's lovely to wake up to these blue skies. It's so nice. It makes you feel a million times better. So, good morning, me, Pat, Peggy, and all my little Peggy friends. Um, Yeah, I hope you're all doing okay, little Bubba. Don't forget to remember, you are fabulous. So, I thought it'd be a good idea last night to drink some Blossom Hill. It's not a good idea to drink Blossom Hill on a school night. <laughs> I woke up this morning and I was like, oh my God, I feel so dead. Oh gosh, so today's going to be a long day. <laughs> I don't drink. I did have a drink last weekend and I did have a drink last night. But before that, I don't think I've drunk since last year. I literally don't drink. Oh my God, I feel so delicate. <laughs> I don't know how people do it all the time. I only had, I think, three glasses and whew, I feel very well rough <laughs> and it's all self-inflicted little mental health potato i hope your mental health is doing okay my darlings i think blue skies whatever do make you feel slightly better they do lift your mood a little bit and it's the little things in life that we have to look for i saw a thing on facebook this morning when i first woke up about some homeless people a poor homeless man had been diagnosed with cancer and he'd had some treatment and then because the hospital needed the beds and obviously if he'd have had a home they'd have sent him home and they just put him out on the streets with his morphine and stuff and oh my god and i read the story and it was so sad it just makes you appreciate the things that you have and oh poor man i think god i'd have given him my blooming home to sleep until he got back to it absolutely heartbreaking that the world has you know become like that that hospitals have sort of had to let people well go home even if they haven't got a home it was so sad bless him uh, anyway so calendar of the day are we ready so monday oh that's a fancy one enjoy this moment oh lovely for a monday morning enjoy this moment right so little lorraine's magic we've got um the most common way people give up their power is by thinking they don't have any and you do everybody has something they're good at right and chanel fashion is not something that exists in dresses only fashion is in the sky in the street fashion has to do with ideas the way we live and what is happening that's right there's house fashion there's all sorts of fashions to look at it's very interesting anyway happy monday my darlings and let's all be a little bit grateful for what we do have oh there you go little piece of england on a monday morning and my washing machine in the background <laughs> My washing machine is so loud. Good morning, Winifred. <laughs> when you found the sunshine. <laughs> He's literally like face down in the carpet. Puppy is so strange. <laughs> and little Dolly's in the kitchen, bless her. Oh. Right, breakfast. So, back on calorie counting for the millionth Monday in a row. But I really do need to get myself in gear because I think I've put about a stone on. My jeans are so tight since Christmas. So, Jane, it's not Christmas anymore. <laughs> right, so are you ready? Lovely Florence. There you go. Dolly, here you go. Hey, come in. There you go. Ooh, lovely cornflake and I think Winifred's just gone back to bed so we'll save Winnie's. Uh, we've got washing to hang out, more washing in the washing machine and then need to eat breakfast. No, in fact we'll have breakfast first then we'll hang the washing out. Here I am. So I've got my Freddy Krueger stroke Dennis Manis jumper on. I don't know whether I really like it or not but I thought I'll wear it for today make my daughter if I want to keep it or if not I'll just put it on my vintage shop. <laughs> it's so funny. I thought it was like Dennis Manis and everybody else was like no it's Freddy Krueger. <laughs> that's scary right so we really need to go and hang the washing out i'm so tired <laughs> oh and it's all self-inflicted <laughs> Appreciate it when we get it for like five minutes. 
heart pains again. Right, I've been on the phone to my mum. So while I've been on the phone to my mum, I've washed up, emptied the dishwasher, pulled my washing out, and it's now uh, about 11 o'clock. Okay, so you know how I love random clothes. Dun, 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 dun. So I bought this. Um, I bought this the other day from the internet. Um, but I don't really like it on me on the models on their website, it looks amazing. Um, but in reality, I just look like a fluffy chicken. <laughs> I love it so much, but I think I'm gonna return it because it's cool. I've tried it on with my like cream trousers to see what it looked like, it didn't look right with my dark jeans. Um, but I just wanted to show you it all before I return it. What do you think? Like the sleeves are amazing. But it does mold. Um, there's quite a lot of fluff been dropping off it while I've tried it on. Uh, so I wouldn't be able to go in my husband's car. He would like moan like anything. Um, and in reality, where can you walk around looking like a fluffy chicken? <laughs> what do you think? I don't know how to return it before I um, do this vlog today. Um, or whether I should wait and see what you all think to it. Um, it is cool and I really love it. But... In reality, I think Jean, you'll not wear it. You've got nowhere to wear it. And why did you have the urge to be a woolly mammoth? I have no idea. <laughs> hmm. So I'm trying it with my jeans. <laughs> I can't make my mind up. And I really need to return it. We get 14 days to send it back. So I don't have to post it back today. But I would like to post it back in the next couple of days. What do we think? <laughs> It's so funny and it's actually really warm because um, it's like Mongolian, like sheepskin stuff. Um, but it is really warm and you take it off, you can feel you've taken it off. So on a cool day, it would be really warm and you know the wind blows. It's so floofy. <laughs> right, from fluff to eggs. <laughs> so for me and a fluffy chicken, I've laid an egg. Right, so... Uh, dinner say obviously you can still have bagels when you're calorie counting and I thought oh I felt something really warm to soak up my alcohol so <clears throat> excuse me so I've got a bagel 10 grams of mozzarella which is not a lot and I have weighed it out properly so I've spread it out one slice of bacon and one egg that I'm going to crack in that little hole when my air fry's warmed up um, this is about 300 calories so it's a nice warm dinner and it'll last me till tea time mm, good job I don't want to go out yet I think they're poking the drains or something. I'm not quite sure what they're doing. Well, when I've eaten my bagel, I want to go out. So they are going to have to move it if they're still there. How embarrassing. Uh, we're going out in Percy today. Woohoo! So that definitely cheers Monday up. Nice coffee while I'm waiting for my bagel to cook. So I've swapped my jumper because I was trying on different jumpers to go with my, my fluffy coat. And now I think I don't really like the stripes. So I think I might sell it. <laughs> I think I prefer a bit of plainness. Okay, there's my dinner. So my friends have got a little bit each, a little bit of bagel, and there's my bacon bit and the egg bit. Off to enjoy it. Hmm, my view while I eat my dinner. <laughs> oh, that's a nice little noise. Sound like a little budgie. Are you a budgie? You sound like a little budgie. You've got rainbows on your face. Ooh, a little rainbow on your little cheek. Right, are you ready? Hang on. <laughs> Okay, so Florence, watch my fingers. Dollykins, get make sure you get your bacon as well, look, because you've got a bit of bacon. Get both, that's it. Um, and Winifred, of course, you can't get out of your bed, can you not? Then? There you go, there's a bit of bacon on the top of it and a bit of bagel. Lovely jubbly. What Mondays were made for munching on bag bacon bagels. Is that nice? <laughs> outside my house and now they're in a big talk with somebody oh god and I really need to get out <laughs> do you think I'll fit out the end of my driveway I'm not sure if I will or not lipstick of the day so lipstick of the day is Avon Hydro Lipstick this is the matte one though not the shiny one and the colour of this one is berry and this is one of the new ones and it's a really, really nice colour. I'm trying to show you where there's no light or blooming rainbows. Look, I was trying to get it in the daylight. It's a really, really nice colour. I don't know if it's the sunshine will show it. 
you can't beat natural daylight. Look, it's lovely. What a lovely colour. And it feels lovely on your lips. It's so nice, these new ones. It's lovely. Right, I'm going to brave it and try and get off the drive without crashing into the lorry. <laughs> oh, gosh, right. We're going to post office, um, drop a parcel off, and then we're going to, like, a junky charity shop for a bit of a remote. I thought they might have a couple of, like, Eastery bits. Um, so, out for it the day, I've put on that plain jumper, swapped my jeans, boots, and then I've got this little jacket on that we got from... It's a Boohoo one, but we got it from one of my charity shop trips. I love it so much. It's so cool. Right. Let's go. Oh, the sat in it drinking bloody coffee. <laughs> I can't believe this. This could only happen to me. Literally, I think I'll be able to squeeze past them. But because I'm in Percy, you're obviously in pink car, so it's even more embarrassing. And then they think, oh, you're a girl, you can't drive. And, oh, wow. Let's hope I get past it. Wow. Well, <clears throat> we made it out. The, <laughs> we made it out the drive. We've arrived at the parcel shop. So I've got to drop this parcel off. Um, and then we'll make our way down to the charity shop. Right, we're back in Percy. So it was a nice little rummage. I bought nothing. <laughs> There's one more we could go to on the way back. I suppose we could go for a quick rummage. I don't know if we can be bothered or not. I might go home and just walk the dogs. We'll see. Anyway, let's go. Right, we've come for another rummage, as you knew that we would. Let's go.
back in Percy. So I didn't mind a bit. <laughs> but I had a nice rummage. I haven't seen any Easter stuff in either of them though. It's really weird. Right, let's go. Right, we've made it home. Oh my God, these sunglasses are ridiculous. Um, I bought these a while ago. I haven't worn them for years. Um, they're absolutely ridiculous. Now look at that sweet moron in them. <laughs> But they were in the glove box so i thought oh i haven't worn them for ages i'm not surprised i haven't worn them because i look so stupid <laughs> anyway let's shut the roof shut the roof off honestly best feeling in the world ever how the hell do you shut it Ooh. oh it was so relaxing you know driving along with the roof off is just so nice oh it was lovely i enjoyed my little drive home right it's about two o'clock thing so we'll see if we can catch dogs take it for a walk right we're in we're in the house so i'm wondering if i might like to go out but i have to watch what i say otherwise they get very excited well not littles and then i can't catch her come on winifred Whee! winifred's coming do you want to come florence as soon as you get a coat out she runs off like that <laughs> so i'm guessing she didn't want to come today right are you ready yeah, I'll wait for you sat on So we've got to drop the paper, we've got to drop the paper off, um, and then go for a walk. made it home so now i've got to come get ruby ruby will not go in percy um she actually hates pink clouds with a passion thinks they're absolutely horrifying and embarrassing so i'm just in my hubby's little con mobile as we call it let's go get ruby hmm still waiting for her cannot believe what a beautiful day it's been today and it wasn't even forecast to be this nice honestly it's been so beautiful right we're home again next job bring the washing back in again Hmm. You can tell Ruby's home because the music starts. <laughs> she always got music on. Right, so now I need to make fake pizzas for Dee. Right, fake pizzas done. So they literally just have to go in the oven for 10 minutes. Delicious. They're really nice. 20 past five. My fake pizza is in the oven. I'm just waiting for it to cook. I'm so hungry now. Ooh. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is my tea. So I've got lots of salad, uh, pop chips. So I've got just the one bag of the sea salt ones. Um, and then my fake pizza. Off to enjoy it. Ooh, my tea was lovely. It's now feeding time. Florence, that's not yours. Winifred. Uh, Winnie. And last but not least, Sir James in the way. 
<laughs> Diggins! Oh, have you got nowhere to spin? Oh, oh dear. Right, hang on. Uh, right, there you go. My final coffee of the day. Ooh, be happy. Oh, my solar light's working again. So it's my little insidey one. And the little outsidey ones, they're so pretty. They were literally from like B&M or something. So pretty. And the solar ones that look like flames and they actually move. Look at that. <laughs> and this is what I have to put with for the rest of the evening. Mm. Wait, did you just trump? I think you did. Midis. Oh, it's a bit grainy in here, isn't it? It's because it's a bit getting a bit dark. Uh, many thanks for joining me again today. I hope you've enjoyed it. I hope we've kept you smiling. Uh, Mondays are a bit, and I felt a bit all day. Oh, and then lovely Pat sent me with more cheesecake. She like, I think she orders like meals and like from an online like meal company thing and then they give you puddings and she keeps defrosting these puddings and giving them to me and they're really nice but i'm trying to be good <laughs> so i came home with this beautiful cheesecake that's now going to sit in the fridge <laughs> it's so mm. hard to be good anyway so i know you're all there with me i know you can sympathize how i feel um i think once you get back in the swing of being good it's easy but I think it takes about two weeks to break the habit of nibbling. And I, at the minute, I'm the queen of nibbling. It's so difficult. <laughs> so anyway, it is. Many thanks for being there with me today. So if you enjoy just a little bit of real life with its ups and downs and its nibbliness, then please subscribe to my channel. Come and find me on Instagram as Mrs. Crazy Bag Lady. My dogs have got Instagram, which is Free Fluffles. My website is down below. My little email shop is down below. So I love you and leave you. I'll see you tomorrow for Tuesday. So happy fluffy Wednesday. Not Wednesday. <laughs> Happy Fluffy Monday, everyone. Bye.